In this video I'll be showing you how to update DirectX 12 the proper way in Windows. So the methods in this video will work for both Windows 10 and 11. So to start off with, DirectX 12 is actually already installed in Windows. So there is no way of downloading and installing DirectX 12, but we can update it. So just to show you that DirectX 12 is actually installed already on your computer, you can check this by opening up the start menu and type in DXDiag. You can then go ahead and open up DXDiag and you then need to press yes. So as you can see straight away here, it says DirectX version and it says DirectX 12. So like I just said, DirectX 12 already comes installed with Windows 10 and 11. But to check that you do have the latest version of DirectX 12, we can do this within the Windows updates. So to do this, all you need to do is right click on the start menu icon and you then need to go to settings. Next, we need to select update and security. If you're using Windows 11, you just need to select Windows update and you then need to click on check for updates button. And also if you do have any optional updates available, you need to download and install those as well. And this is how DirectX 12 is updated through the Windows update. So you can also update previous versions of DirectX, for example, DirectX 9 and 10 and 11. This can be done by downloading a tool from the Microsoft website. So to do this, you need to click on the link that's in the description below. Once you've clicked on the link, you will end up on a page that looks like this. And as you can see here, it says this will update DirectX 9, 10, 11. It will not install DirectX 12. That's because, like I said, it's done through the Windows updates. So to update these previous versions of DirectX, first you need to select your language and then go download. Once the file's finished downloading, go ahead and run the file. You will then end up with a window that looks like this. We now need to agree to the terms, so if you do, press I accept and then go next. You can then choose if you want to install the Bing bar or not, I don't want to, and then press next. It will now check to see if there are any updates available. If there are, then it will download and install them. But as you can see, I already have the latest files for DirectX. So that is how you update DirectX 12, 11, 10 and 9 in Windows 10 and 11. I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed it. If you did like the video, click the like button below. And if you'd like to see more computer sluggish videos, then click that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.